All right, ladies and germs, a quick update on the hobby side of my life. Um, I haven't gotten anything else painted. Uh, real life and work, I've been getting overtime, and overtime is good for your bank account, bad for your, your gaming. Um, Itic Beer, I'm sorry, I couldn't remember your name for half a second. Itic Beer has put up a Get It Painted Challenge for 2016, and I'm going to take part in it as best I can. Um, I'm going to be working on my Scorn Battle Box here. Uh, as you can tell, I've already gotten some work done on this guy. I did a previous video on him, and I actually did a video on all this before, but this is a new video. And I got some more work done on him, not a whole bunch. I'm going to sit down at the painting table, hopefully in the next few days, and get some work done. Uh, I'm going to work on the Scorn guy here especially the ones that don't have any of the armor or stuff done. Um, the Warlock, I'm probably going to save for last. He has loads of detail in his model, and I want to do a really good job. Guest appearance by my dog, Jazz. Um, but that's really what I'm going to put into the Let's Paint It, Get It Painted Challenge for Itic Beer. And I hope to have this box done. I I'm going to set a realistic goal, given my current schedule. I hope to have this box done let's call it the end of November. Um, I've got a gaming convention coming up where I have to run a whole bunch of stuff for Privateer Press and assist the people running the tournaments. So I'd like to have this box done feasibly by the end of November. Hopefully sooner. If I get, you know, some free time where I can sit down at my table and I'm not in the middle of doing other things, then this will be a priority. However, if that doesn't happen, End of November is my personal goal. I think that's a month that's more than enough time for me to sit down and paint these guys and get them to a a decent tabletop standard. They're not going to be winners of the next uh, P3 competition or anything else, but they'll be painted. You'll be able to say, yes, that's a painted model. It looks decent. It looks clean. And that's really all I'm after. Um, hope you all have enjoyed the video. Post up what y'all are working on. Get in on Itic Beer's... Uh, painting challenge i'll put a link to the google group in the description below and just come out and paint i mean it doesn't matter what you paint paint anything you could paint war machine hordes you could paint warhammer 40k you could paint whatever the age of sigmar is now that's out infinity show us your painted models let's get the hobby side of the community back together let's get this going again i enjoy painting models i enjoy looking at painted models that people have painted themselves and it's really fun if you can get the group think together, so to speak, and just show your work. I mean, it doesn't have to be beautiful. I'm making this video on a, on a phone. You don't have to have an excellent setup where you've got lights and everything else. Just come out and, and show your painted models. Even if you think it looks terrible, show it. Because trust me, if it's got three colors on it and it's on the table, I'm not going to make fun of it. I'm going to say, you made an effort. You, you painted your model. Granted, you may not think it looks nice. You may you can't compare yourself to a guy that's been painted for 20 years if you just started. Or if you just don't have that skill set because you haven't spent the time to develop it. And this is a perishable skill. The longer you go without painting, you lose some of your ability. Throw your painted stuff on the table. It doesn't matter if all you did was put three colors and seal it. There's three colors and it's sealed. Let's see what it looks like. I'd love to see them. Okay? I will not make make fun of your work in any way just come out and show it anyway hope everybody has enjoyed the video a little bit of a rant there i'll get off my soapbox and to all my american friends one political thing i will say go vote please for the love of god go vote and put out there that you know your opinion and take your civic duty and vote it's very important that you go vote especially in this election i don't care who you vote for just go vote. Anyway, political rant over. Y'all have a good one.